Hi, I moved my camera down so you didn't have to see my freaky um, ceiling fan. It works right in here, but on video for some reason it looks like it's possessed. So yeah, instead you get the boobage. Sorry. Um, kitty's here. Say hi. Oops, wrong way. Say, oops, still wrong way. I'm retarded. There she is. Say hi. Hi. Okay, you're not. Um, there will be sheets on my bed tomorrow, guaranteed, because I have company coming. So, yeah. Um, I'm going to actually put purple tie-dye ones on there. So, woo. -hoo. Uh, my friend Evie and her fiancé Harris, she goes by Blue-Eyed Lady and a number, 70-something. And her fiancé Harris is Quantum XL. He's, a um, he did a lot of Rubik's Cube videos. Um. He had gone on vacation with Tillman and I um, a couple years ago, over a couple years ago. Mom was still alive. And um, we had snuck him to go on vacation to meet Evie because they liked each other and were kind of dating internet-wise, but they'd never met. So we snuck him with us. He took the train from New York to here. He was on the train for a day, and then we picked him up at the train station not far from me, and then he went on a road trip with us. So, it'll be nice to see them all again. I haven't seen them in forever. I'm so excited. They've been on vacation. Listen to this, people. They left. They live in Long Island. And they left there, and they went to Louisiana to visit her family. That's where she's from. And then they left there and went up to North Dakota to visit a friend. And they are on the road now. They left this morning from North Dakota, and they're going to stop here. And then they're going to go home. Um, they were going to try to get here tonight, but the weather's so crappy and rainy that they're taking their time and they're going to um, stop tonight when they get tired. Because if they kept driving, they wouldn't get here till like 1 or 2 o'clock in the morning. And I said, just if you're too tired, don't, you know. So they're going to get here tomorrow. And I'm excited. And I, 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 I hope they stay for two nights. It's um, And they have their little dog. They have a little Pomeranian. So, I sprung that one on the humper today. He knew they were coming. I'm like, he goes, yeah, when your crew gets here. I'm like, my crew, it's just Harris and Evie and their dog. And he goes, dog? I'm like, yeah. <laughs> they had her shaved. And she looks so cute. She looks almost like a um, chihuahua right now with a little poofy tail. She's very cute. Um, I saw a picture of it on Facebook. So, I'm excited and giddy because... I need some socialization with some of my friends. And I hardly ever get to see her, so I'm excited. Did I say that already? Huh? Um, I'm also in pain. I'm only going to say this for a brief moment. I figured out I don't have lower back pain. I have um, a bad left hip. That's pretty much because it's the same exact pain I had in my knee when my knee started going bad. It's not in my left hip. And I can't afford to go to the doctor in a cortisone shot through my ortho. They do that at the hospital instead of in the office because apparently it's a little more difficult because it's got to be a bigger needle and stuff. And the idea of that right now just does not sound good to me. So I'm just living with the pain. So, yay. Um, like right now I smell like um, Ben Gay. I do. And you know how you wash your hands and you'll itch yourself later and you'll feel it tingle because... Some Ben Gay is still, there's residue somewhere. I hate when that happens. Especially when you rub your eye. I haven't done that yet. I don't plan on it either. So, yeah, Stacy's falling apart. Let's just put it that way. Um, and I'm getting ready to make a grocery list. Uh, because we gotta buy kitty litter for your stinky bootay. Hey, stinky bootay. She's like, I I ain't got no stinky booty. She's not paying no attention to me. And um, some things that are on sale at Myers. They got their 10 for 10. I'm going to get some bag salad because they got salad on sale for a dollar. And I usually get some vegetables. And usually dad will buy biscuits. I got to look through this and see what. And they have my feminine product on sale right there always for 95 And I have a dollar off coupon. Come on now. Um, see, now you know more about me than you really want to know, don't ya? But I get excited over things like that. Um, oh, 
J.C. Shanks, Johnny, for all, those of you people who know him, because he wrote me an email, and I have it minimized. I need to, um, he has not been around because he's been in the hospital, very sick. I wondered what had happened to him, and I got an email saying, and he wants me to pass on a video about um, he's not uh, feeling well. And I hope you don't mind me reading some of this, Johnny, because I'm going to tell him what's wrong with you. Um, he just got out of the hospital. His liver was failing, but they saved it chemically. And he's going to have to have a transplant. They don't know if he is strong enough for or how long it will take for him to get a match. Uh, not only does he have a morphine pump in his belly now, now they surgically implanted a med port in his chest that goes um, to his um, main heart vein so they can just attach him to an IV instead of having to stick him in the vein all the time. My mom had one of those pick lines. Um, they also put a filter screen in... Um, his groin to catch any blood clots from his legs so they don't reach the heart or lungs. So Johnny's not doing the peachy keenest. And Lizzie, he told me specifically to let you know. Um, and he told me he loved me and, and to tell everybody that, you know, that that's the reason he hasn't been around. And so Johnny, I hope you're feeling better. And I understand if you don't even see this video, but I'm doing my job and passing along the information. So that's J.C. Shanks. Um, he's such a sweet man. I love the Johnny. So he's in my prayers. And so everybody keep him in your prayers. Because that's a lot of stuff going on right there. Uh, anything else I have to say? I gotta get ready to call Evie because she's gonna make homemade enchiladas while she's here. I said, you and you need to cook together. I said, what do you want to have? And she says, well, Harris has been wanting me to make enchiladas. I said, well, the humper will like that because Mexican food's one of his favorites. It is. My dad can eat Mexican and Italian food every day. I'm more of the Indian and Chinese food every day person. So I'm gonna get some Spanish rice too and uh some salad, stuff like that. So I gotta get that on my list. And if you noticed, I uploaded another video, a flip video today. Woo woo! I have two more at work to upload. The last one is a really interesting one. It's all Lizzie, and it's her, I made her tell one of her concert stories, and it's really, um, it's fun to listen to her concert stories, because she has a lot of them, and they're so fun. Yeah. All right, that's about all, people. So, I'm moseying on. Kitty, do you want to say goodbye? Come on. Come here, come here, say goodbye. There she is. Say bye. Oh, you want to smell my finger? That's not the Ben Gay one. You're lucky. Yeah. All right, bye.